Good morning. It's Tuesday, July the 21st. This morning's call to prayer. Bless the Lord, you angels of his, you mighty ones who do his bidding and hearken to the voice of his word. Bless the Lord, all you his hosts, you ministers of his who do his will. Bless the Lord, all you works of his in all places of his dominion. The request for presence today, show us your mercy, O Lord, and grant us your salvation. This morning's greeting, my mouth shall recount your mighty acts and saving deeds all day long, though I cannot know the number of them. The refrain for the morning lessons, he looks at the earth and it trembles. He touches the mountains and they smoke. Today's Gospel reading from the book of Luke. It happened that one day he got into a boat with his disciples and said to them, Let us cross over to the other side of the lake. So they set out, and as they sailed, he fell asleep. When a squall came down on the lake, the boat started shipping water, and they found themselves in danger. So they went to rouse him, saying, Master, Master, we are lost. Then he woke up and rebuked them. Excuse me, he woke up and rebuked the wind and the rough water, and they subsided and it was calm again. He said to them, Where is your faith? They were awestruck and astonished and said to one another, Who can this be that gives orders even to the winds and waves? And they obey him. He looks at the earth and it trembles. He touches the mountains and they smoke. This morning's psalm. Awesome things will you show us in your righteousness, O God of our salvation, O hope of all the ends of the earth and of the seas that are far away. You make fast, you make fast the mountains by your power. They are girded about with might. You still the roaring seas, the roaring waves, and the clamor of their peoples. Those who dwell at the ends of the earth will tremble at your marvelous signs. He looks at the earth, and it trembles. He touches the mountains, and they smoke. The earth is the Lord's, and all the fullness thereof, the world, and we who dwell within. Thanks be to God. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread, and forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. The prayer appointed for this week. Almighty God, the fountain of all wisdom, you know my necessities before I ask, and my ignorance in asking. Have compassion on my weakness, and mercifully give me those things which, for my unworthiness, I dare not, and for my blindness I cannot ask. Through the worthiness of your Son, Jesus Christ, my Lord, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. The concluding prayer of the Church. Lord God, almighty and everlasting Father, you have brought me in safety to this new day. Preserve me with your mighty power, that I may not fall into sin, nor be overcome by adversity. And in all I do, direct me to the fulfilling of your purpose, through Jesus Christ my Lord. Amen. May God bless you today and always.